Hello friends, welcome back to our Linux tutorial series. In today's video, we will discuss about one more file system which is temporary. In previous video, we have discussed about slash TMP. Today, we will discuss about slash VAD TMP and what's the difference between TMP and VAD TMP. Why? If TMP is already present, why we have introduced VAD TMP? So, VAD TMP is a directory location in Linux for temporary storing the file. This serve a similar purpose like a slash temp directory but slightly different why slash tmp generally clean up on a system reboot or after 10 days where where tmp has preserved across reboot and providing a longer term of temporary storage options unlikely slash temp directory which is clean automatically during the system reboot files and directory within the where tmp are meant to preserve for a longer duration other than slash tmp similar to slash tmp where temp allow to share across among multiple users and processes Okay, now if you see ls -l -d slash where tmp, this is also having the sticky bit enable on this file system. Okay, so unlikely that slash tmp, which is clean automatically during the system reboot file system and directory within the where temp, are meant to preserve for a longer duration. This makes where tmp suitable for storing temporary file, which may need for accessible or retained between system across the reboot. Treatment of where TMP directory may be depending on the specific system policy and configuration. Some system may choose to clear the where TMP during the periodic maintenance task or otherwise may leave to a system untouched. If often ill used, longer running process and application that require temporary storage for data and such include like backup utility, batch processing and certain application that this is also you have to maintain like monitor with your monitoring tool. If slash where is getting full, manually you have to clean up. Else, you know the file. This is the file get usr lib tempfsd tempfs. Here, if you see where tmp is having permission, root root 30 days. And here also we are excluding system d private in this thing. If you want to change the setting, you can change here and reboot the system. So that's the conclusion. Slash where tmp directory provide a longer term of temporary storage option in Linux. Its persistence across the system reboot and make it suitable for temp storing the temporary file which may need and the retention period should be extended. Uh, understanding the difference between where DMP and where temp is crucial. Only thing both are storing the same temporary data but slash where TMP is saving the data for 30 days and TMP is having the data for 10 days only. There's a basic difference in temp and where temp both are serving using a sticky bit special permission. So that's all for today's video. Thanks for watching. If you found this video informative, do like, share and subscribe to our channel. If you are having any question and suggestion, please leave them in the comment box. Keep learning. See you next video. Till then. Bye-bye.